Uh, we're going to switch gears, guys, because we've got a, a disturbing story we want to mm. tell you about, and it's that bombshell arrest of cheer star Jerry Harris. The 21-year-old is behind bars this morning as he is facing allegations of producing child pornography. This as a new USA Today investigation uncovers nearly 180 individuals affiliated with cheerleading who have faced charges involving misconduct with minors but weren't actually uh, banned by the sport. Gio Benitez has more on this. Good morning, Gio. Hey, Cecilia, good morning. Yeah, this story comes as a shock to so many fans of that Netflix show, Cheer. Jerry Harris was interviewed by law enforcement this week, and now this arrest. You got a squad? Yes! Bro, get it up, bro! He's a breakout star of the hot Netflix docuseries, Cheer. 21-year-old Jerry Harris ruled the mat. Get a shot! Let's go, Jerry! And the Oscars red carpet. You're going to go to L.A. and be Ellen's correspondent on the red carpet of the Oscars. Teaming up with everyone from Ellen DeGeneres to Oprah. Jerry, we want a nap talk for the but this morning, Harris is waking up to a very different reality. Arrested and charged in Chicago federal court with producing child pornography. The TV star accused of contacting two underage boys on social media and repeatedly asking them to produce and send sexually explicit videos and photographs of themselves. Allegations he denies. If convicted, Harris could face 15 to 30 years in prison. The family is feeling a tremendous sense of relief today that they were heard. Um, and that they are being believed and that the truth will ultimately come out. Netflix telling ABC News, like everyone, we are shocked by this news. Any abuse of minors is a terrible crime and we respect the legal process. And now another bombshell allegation rocking the world of cheerleading. A new exclusive USA Today investigation identifying nearly 180 people affiliated with the sport who have faced charges for crimes relating to sexual misconduct involving minors, but were not banned by the sport's two governing bodies, U.S. All-Star Federation and USA cheer. The U.S. All-Star Federation requires people who go backstage or into warm-up areas at competitions to be members of the organization and to be background checked. But the U.S. All-Star Federation doesn't actually tell those gyms that they can't hire someone who has a conviction on their record or someone who's facing active charges. The paper finding that as many as 140 adults, including coaches and choreographers, have criminal histories and 74 are registered sex offenders. Among them, Ohio gym owner and coach Michelle Robinson, a convicted felon who helps operate a gym sanctioned by USASF, and told USA Today she put her sister's name on the application because she knew her 2006 conviction for sexual battery of a 17-year-old boy would show up on a background check. My sister um, is actually the registered owner uh, with USASF. At a competition, I can't, you know, go in the back or anything like that. I'm a paid spectator when I go. Um, there's no way I could ever pass their background check. They're very strict about it. Overnight, USA Cheer telling ABC News, USA Cheer takes sexual misconduct and abuse very seriously. Providing a healthy and safe environment for kids to train and compete is our highest priority. Unfortunately, we live in a world where we, of course, want to trust people, but we also have to be diligent about checking information and making sure that the people who are around our children are safe. And a vice president over at USASF told USA Today that the organization leads the way on athlete safety, adding, I think you would be hard pressed to find another youth sports organization that has dedicated the time and the effort that we have to these non-sporting resources. For more on this investigation, you can check out USA Today right now. Cecilia. Okay, Gio, thank you. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here, so go on click the subscribe button right over right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day anytime we thank you for watching and we'll see you in the morning on GMA